A local woman was so inspired by her service dog that she's actually written a book about him. Tonight, Larry Himmel introduces us to the world according to Honey Bear. For the past three years, Catherine Rodriguez and her dog Honey Bear have been inseparable. She wakes me up every morning and spends all day with me. I mean, she goes everywhere I go. So if, if I go on a plane, she goes with me. If I go to the Padre game, she goes with me. Catherine has spent most of her life as an educator until diagnosed with Parkinson's disease in 1999. Honey Bear spent the first two years of her life in training to be a service dog. And not everybody makes the cut? No, most dogs don't. They need to have a good temperament. They also need to be able to work well with people. Even though it was love at first sight, Catherine and Honey Bear underwent a six-week bonding period. They have to train me. She was trained, but uh, humans are not as well trained as dogs. Service dogs need to be strong enough to assist Parkinson's patients in walking. As they call it the Parkinson's shuffle, we walk with real small steps and then we fall over. Well, she sets my gait so that I walk with her gait and then I walk better and I don't fall down. If I freeze, which is a occurrence with Parkinson's, your, your brain tells your feet to move and your body ignores it. And um, she, she'll, she just puts her paw on my, on my foot, not my paw, on my foot, and I start walking again. Honey Bear so inspired Catherine, and Catherine so inspired Honey Bear that they've co-authored a book, The World According to Honey Bear, a tail wagging tail told in the first person. She moves slowly and gets tired, and that's when I, Honey Bear, come to the rescue. The five-year-old Pyrenees Shepherd Labrador mix recounts humorous and poignant stories from her daily life. It's a lighthearted book with a heartfelt message for the reader. I want them to, to be able to understand what Parkinson's is and how much help a dog can be. If you ask Honey Bear, she'll tell you she's just doing her job, a job she loves one step at a time. Larry Himmel, News 8. Now, all profits from the sale of the book benefit the Parkinson's Association. For information on how to order the world according to Honey Bear, just log on to our website, cbs8.com, and click on the hot button.